The Honorable Member for Saint-Jean. Mr. Speaker, it's not just up to the NDP to protect our election system or the Bloc Québécois or the Conservatives, and clearly not the Liberals. It's all of us who are responsible for protecting our system. The Prime Minister seems to not understand that the, that the integrity of our democracy is threatened. We should all feel involved in finding a solution. All the parties are asking for a public and independent public inquiry. Why is the Prime Minister refusing to implement that? The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, on the contrary, I am not refusing to implement that review. I know that Canadians need to be able to trust our democracy and our electoral system. And that is why I will be asking a special rapporteur to be appointed so that they can reassure Canadians outside of party lines that everything is being done right, and also to issue recommendations if necessary. The Honourable Member. Mr. Speaker, whatever the Prime Minister says, the electoral system doesn't belong to him and his party. This is not a liberal issue. This is a democratic issue. No one should have any doubt about the fact that everyone in this House has been elected legitimately without interference or trickery. And that means that we can't have secret meetings and special rapporteurs chosen by the Prime Minister. Why is the Prime Minister refusing to create a public and independent inquiry, which is what everyone is asking for? The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, I agree with the majority of what my... Well, the Prime Minister got so much applause that I'm going to let him start over. Mr. Speaker, in this House, we all agree about the fact that it's crucial to protect our electoral system and its institutions beyond partisanship. And that is why we will be choosing an independent figure to ensure that the mechanisms brought forward are right. Yes, we've heard from some experts who said that an inquiry is the right thing to do, but others have said that it's not the best way to move forward. And so as far as I'm concerned, I think that letting an independent special rapporteur, an expert, decide on this, I think that's the right decision for all of us.